One thing I, I don't think I've ever um, discussed with you is your, your background on the motorsport administrative side because you love it and you've been immersed in it for some time, haven't you? Yeah, I mean, Rusty, I've been in the motorsport industry to all my life. I, um, when I left school, I started as a mechanic with BMW, so I've always kind of been in things. So I was BMW 20 years, in Porsche for a while, um, Porsche in Hong Kong, number of things, so it's been pretty cool. We worked in Germany, so it's been quite amazing. I guess for my motorsport thing, I used to run the Porsche uh, GT3 Cup when I was part of part of Girl Track Group, so I did that for a little while. I was involved a little bit with um, Porsche uh, Career Cup in Asia, and then obviously back here, I'm um, now doing Golden Homes GT New Zealand Championship category. It's been amazing. And a lot of hard work has gone in to get to this point. Yeah. Uh, on balance, it looks like a fantastic start. Great roll up of cars, yep. perfect place to start it here at Highlands, isn't amazing. it? Amazing. Look, it's like everything. I think when you start a new category and a new business, um, year one's always kind of challenging. But we've had some amazing support. You know, the, the, the guys have been extremely supportive. We've got 23, you know, for, for the first round, some amazing brands and really a great bunch of people. You know, the, the whole thing with this category was about trying to create, I guess, sort of that, that sort of old style of racing where we got people and they enjoyed each other's company. We can have a beer afterwards and also involve friends, families, colleagues. So it's a really nice community and that's what we've tried to create. That's one part of, a, of the equation. On the other side of a collection of cool cars that would appeal to younger viewers yeah. as well, you've got both GT4 and some GT3 spec machines in this, haven't you? So, so we've got two categories. We've got an open category, which is basically um, the 911 Porsche GT3 Cup cars. Um, we've got a Lamborghini Super Trofeo and Ferrari 488 Challenger. So they're kind of in the open. And in terms of GT4, we've got sort of Aston Martin, uh, we've got Porsche Cayman, we've got McLaren, we've got um, a number of other amazing brands. Um, so we, we're wrapped um, with what we've achieved. And I think, I mean, from a spectacle thing, we've always said we want to try and deliver something for Kiwi motorsport fans that they can only see in other places of the world. And we're going to deliver it here in New Zealand at really New Zealand's greatest circuit. So it's amazing. For the competitors, for the, the constituents in the, the paddock and pit lane here too, the kind of offering of racing in, in the way that you've regulated it is cool too. It's got a sort of mini endurance feel basically, doesn't it? Correct. So each weekend we have two 30 minute races and a 60 minute race. And the thing we've tried to do is make it interesting, not only for the competitors, but also for, for the viewers and the fans. So every race features a pit stop. So we've got that whole coming into the pits, there's activity, there's things happening and all that sort of stuff. And then going out and then of course the faster cars passing the slower cars. So it really makes it an interesting spectacle. The other thing we've done is we've also announced the 2024 calendar already. So we'll be underway in November, five round series for, for next year. So it's just going to get bigger, it's just going to get better. Um, and certainly with the support of you know, the promoters and all the teams and the sponsors, I think we'll be able to deliver something, a really world class product.